We're going to convert the function y equals negative 5x squared minus 40x minus 73 to vertex form by partial factoring. We're going to begin by common factoring out the first two terms, including the leading coefficient. And once we have this, we can determine where this parabola crosses the line y equals negative 73 by letting the first part of this expression equal 0 and solving for x. Well, that would mean x is either 0 or negative 8. We can determine the axis of symmetry by adding these two values and dividing by 2. And so the axis of symmetry of our parabola is x equals negative 4. We can then determine the y value of the vertex by plugging in the x value to either the first or second line. Well, we know the x value of the vertex is negative 4, so we know the y value of the vertex is 7. So what we now have is a situation where we know the leading coefficient of negative 5, the x value of the vertex is negative 4, and the y value is 7. Well, using all that information allows us to state that y equals negative 5 times x plus 4 quantity squared plus 7.